Live from the studio of his parents' basement, the Have You Seen It podcast. Hello and welcome back to the Have You Seen It podcast. My name is Mason Knight. Sitting across from me is the one and only Cash Krause. But before we begin, if you guys can please be sure to smash that like button, comment below, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell notification as we drop videos here every single day. So with that said, Cash, what are we recapping today? Today we are doing, well, it's TV Tuesday. Of course. Of course. And if you saw the thumbnail and the title, you probably already know. But uh, this TV Tuesday will be weird because it's TV Tuesday for about, Two weeks. <laughs> yeah. That's With the way this, this will be uh, released, but still under the title of TV <laughs> the Tuesday. The 2V, 2V Tuesday. There we go. TV Tuesday banner. It's yes. still under there. Still under it. It has to be. Family Man, Episode 5, Homecoming. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. Uh, like, a, like a high school homecoming football game? What are we doing here? <laughs> no, it's like a terrorist homecoming. Oh, shit. That, not as fun. A lot more explosives. Yeah, I'd say they've, so. They've figured out, uh, th- they learned their lesson from the first one. They're like, we're not doing the gas. No. The gas was so stupid. Stupid. So last year. Oh, so people aren't doing gas yeah. anymore. C4 is in yes. this year. It's the hot so one. So for car 1.0. Yeah. Trust me, we got 2.0. 2.0 is better than it's ever. It's going to be better. Better than ever. Should have been uh, plan A. And but you know how expensive C4 gets. It's like gold. It goes up every year. Every you gotta, single year. That's why you got to bury it somewhere. Buy it cheap. Bury that. Yep. Only goes up in profit. And then make a huge profit, huge turnaround make in three to five years. a killing. I'll make a killing. I like it. Get it? Cause they're, like it. Right, because they're, they're going to explode a lot of people. people. I assume right. so. I don't know the full details of the plan yet right i know it involves a plane it does still not clear on on how it involves the best fighter pilot of all time raji well the greatest prop plane fighter (laughs) she can't fly (laughs) anything that goes over 100 miles an hour very true but uh she's pretty good she is she's pretty damn good yeah and uh but this episode starts out with our main guy sir khan and And some big miss i thought this was gonna last like 10 minutes they'd be like hey you get it. You know, we made a mistake. Right. My God, does she make a big, just a big fuck up. Uma Yall just takes JK's phone, throws it in a bucket it's not, of water. It's not even bad, like, just, like, arresting them and not even believing them. But, like, now you're, like, what? Well, you're being malicious. Yeah, yeah, now they have are. reasons to, like, be like, hey, this lady should be fired. Yeah, she should be. Look how she's handling these. So Kant was very gracious, though. When the old boss man shows up, lets him out, she's like, oh, I'm sorry, big misunderstanding. And they're like, you should have gave us a phone call. Yeah. Well, the thing, this whole thing, the thing with the phone out. was they gave – uh they were, she was going to give him his phone, but they had, for his boss's name, he had like a cuss, a cuss word, word on it. So yeah. she thought she was messing. But which, how could he, me- did he know that you were going to arrest, arrest him? So he like immediately changed the <laughs> right. contacts into his phone. It would take a really long time actually, but clearly not thinking. Again, not the best cops. No. I mean, we haven't seen one yet. We have not. Not a good cop. <laughs> not a competent not just cop. Just a cop that comes in does nine to five job we haven't seen yet. Uh, but yeah, so big misunderstanding uh, ends up working out. She gets a promotion out of it. I don't know how. I don't know how you screw up and get a promotion. You fail up. It's like you America. It is <laughs> like America. Yeah, very true. Very true. Uh, yeah, she she screws up massively. Uh, ends up resting the people like ahead of task force. Yeah. They say, hey, did a good enough job there. Join task. <laughs> Trust me, because we're all we'll super competent. Here. Anyone? Yeah, we yeah. will. Because uh, a lot of our guys are dying. So, uh, yeah, and a lot of them have PTSD. They do. Are pretty shaken up. Pan yeah. over to the guy. Shell shocked. He's he's just he's <laughs> a fucking up ten thousand mile stare. You know, he's staring right through uh, people. Uh, yeah, so like fuck shit, she can join. And not even that, JK. He's got a thing for her. Oh, yeah. You saw that immediately because nothing says I love you like throwing someone's phone in a bucket of water. Yeah, and they even go phone shopping at one oh, point. Oh, that was like, cute. And she bought it for him. How sweet. We get it, but you don't got to hire your girlfriend. You know, we don't want her at the job. Yeah. <laughs> we don't, we don't, we don't, it's just... I mean, good for him, but for everyone else, makes things uh, a little more difficult. <laughs> yeah, for yeah. sure. We got to lug her around now. Uh and, yeah, so that's it. She pretty much joins the task force after the big mix-up of them thinking that they were fucking serial killers. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, she had every reason to arrest them. But, yeah, so they uh, 
they figure that out, and then they figure out who Raji is. Because they're like, oh, you mean you're looking for this girl? Mm-hmm. And they're like, oh, my Where God. Where did we see her? Oh, that's Big right. Fuck yeah. Big you let her go. Up. Yeah. Uh, and they figure out. They somehow figure out, even though that they took this body apart, she she uh, dissected these fuckers. They're like, killed him by the hands. By hands. Hand-to-hand <laughs> combat. So she must be a trained skilled fighter. You see this fighter. severed head right here? Right. You look very carefully. You, you see the vertebrae? It's it's actually <laughs> severed off the spine. Yeah, that was hand-to-hand combat. <laughs> yeah, she ripped that guy's head off. Yeah. So they're like, whoa, super soldier. Yep. Clearly, she's killing a lot of people. And they even find a training video. And they do, she, and, and she's, she's like in it. an instructor. So yeah. they're like, "Whoa, that's uh, that's the thing about those training videos. You know, yeah. you're giving away too much. You are <laughs> too many faces of your yeah, uh, rebels." Sure. But they're like, "Oh my god, we uh, big screw up because so many people have let her go at this point, mm. Rajia, and now she's very angry. She wants vengeance. I think in this in this episode, she talks about killing everyone. She does." She and she wants to kill everyone. Yeah, like she's uh, and she pretty much kills everyone she comes in contact with. Yeah, I'd say so. But the whole thing in this episode is they are going to unbury the C four at Pedro's point. Yeah, Point Pedro. Point Pedro. Which is a Hispanic sounding. <laughs> it is. It's a very, <laughs> very uh, Hispanic sounding port. But uh, Raji, not a fan of Point Pedro, hits the sign with a shovel. And no one likes when Sajid Pedro. knows, oh, she, she, this bitch, she hates everyone. Yeah, he's <laughs> yeah. like, oh my she God. She got a lot of hate. Perfect for the squad. But. <laughs> yeah, well, even he's like a little too much. Like, yeah. Dial it back. Jeez. We're terrorists, but, you know, we got to have good days too. <laughs> yeah, so they, they have to go and they hire some, some the, the town drunk they hire. This guy can't go get figure. it together. <laughs> yeah, go figure useless. Yep. Completely useless. And then, uh, you know, they kill guards, a couple guards when they're... That was a cool scene. It was a cool scene. And you just knew it was coming, though. Kind of framed him. But yeah, you knew he was going to die. Well, I mean, sure. you knew she was going to kill those guys. Like, at this point, it's oh, like, yeah, you yeah. bring more than two. Yeah. How many times have we done this? I know. How many times have we danced this dance? <laughs> I mean, it's... She's walking through guys, yeah. We got to talk about this. Doesn't kill the drunk, though. Let's make that clear. N- well, hits him over the head with a shovel. Just to knock him. I think she kind of needed him alive mm-hmm. to be like, you got to blame this guy now. Yeah, exactly. Because, uh, I mean, he'll he'll throw everyone under the bus, but at, by the time, it's going to be over. So It doesn't look good, yeah. We got to talk about this, though. Our Vind and Sushi are back oh together. My God, I could not care less the about this. The awkward yeah. tension between these two. He's still trying. He's still trying to sling that dick. He's and like, Sushi's just, like, oh, my God. Well, you see him go over there. He goes, one more time. Yeah. Like, uh, no, I'm Let's married? talk to HR. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, do you have an HR department in this new shrink me uh, office? I get that you did it when we were ro- rolling out of a Starbucks, but now you got an office. Things are different, boss. <laughs> you you got to quit with this yeah. harassment. Yeah. And they have a family day. Yeah. Because they, a well, big thing in this is they sell the app to someone, but they have to make, they have to go to London. It's always London. Always London. They have, yeah. A lot of London in this episode, too, because mm-hmm. they're going, what's the guy's name? Baccaron or something? I can't remember. Yeah, close. It's the guy who they think, he's like, you got to check this guy out. He's definitely planning something. Baccaron. Yeah. Baccaron. Remember? Baccaron. Yeah, close. Baccaron. But remember, they're like, we got to watch this guy because mm-hmm. he's up to something. And then that's like all London shot. But uh, yeah, she. they say you have to go to London in two weeks. And she's like, I can't. I got kids. Especially when she doesn't even know where the husband's at. Right. She finds out in this. (laughs) He's in Shanae. She's like, all right, whatever. Is that like another country? Well, no one's one's answering poor Sakran's phone calls except his son. Useless son. All his son does is wants to blackmail dad. Hey, dad, new iPhone coming out. I need the new iPhone. Why don't you pre-order that bad boy for me? And then I'll give you some information on the family. He just, his dad says, he just keep me updated. That's all I want. Keep me updated. I'm the dad. Yeah. Useless. And the, her daughter, if the daughter catches the phone that when he's calling, mm. no chance. No. D-Tree, she, she wants nothing to do with that. She's hanging up other people's phones, dude. She hates that guy. But, uh, yeah, it's it's falling apart as far. I don't know why she wouldn't go to London. Let those kids just go on their own. Just let them do their thing. At yeah, this let, point, let I mean. Let become street youth. D-Tree's uh, dating a, a terrorist at this point. Just let her be. That guy, man. Now that guy's fucking fallen in love, and now he he's is. second guessing me. At t- I did not think yeah. that was gonna happen. No, but uh, I think ultimately, Terrace got a terrorist, and I think I he- hope so. I can't yeah. imagine a terrorist giving up 
a dedicated life for one girl. For, one girl. That he's yeah. met maybe a couple weeks. Three weeks, maybe at most. <laughs> at most, yeah. Who has thought about pushing her off a ledge <laughs> yeah, multiple the first, times. The first date. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't imagine. It, what I know what's going to happen is the family's going to end up getting kidnapped and Sakran's going to end up having, and that's what's going to bring them all Oh, together. for sure. Absolutely. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, so, like we said, Suchi is still f- trying to get her hu- or her boss off of her. Yeah. But they do have that family day where they say, hey, you got to go to London in two weeks. And the, one of the guys just says, hey, make it happen. Mm-hmm. Jesus, dude. Just relax. Yeah, I know. I can't do it. I got kids. So that's what's going on with Suchi. And, like, b- back to Baskaron or, or whatever, uh, yeah. he ends up disappearing. He escapes. The, of Watch course. this guy. The raw Watch agents. Watch this guy. Raw agents just One blow job. It. Blow it. One they job. blew it in Sacred Games. They're blowing it here. <laughs> Come on. Just watch him. Just fucking watch them. Hey, by the way, his lights haven't been on since yesterday. Yeah, Should we eight go check days. In? It's been yeah. a week, and I haven't seen this guy. Are We've we, been sitting in this Should we be working? <laughs> I mean, we just went out and got pizza why, again. Why but, did uh, you not call in yeah, earlier? You should have called in six days he's, ago. He's on the uh, flight to Cheney or oh, whatever. No, he's, he's already in Cheney <laughs> by the time these assholes realize what's going on. <laughs> yeah, it's brutal. They can't do anything no. right. But uh, only oh, learn about uh, there's, there's one term that... Uh, Task learns about uh, what is it? It's Unit Fifty Two, Local Fifty Two, Local. They have no idea what this is. Ends up being just uh, the boat that gets them to Pager's Point, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, and they can't figure that out or anything. But right now, the terrorists have a bunch of C four. They do. And the 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 thing with this C four, we'll see in the next episode, is like they got to go get the detonators from a different spot. Mm -hmm. Why because they bear that the, shit with them. Didn't they say when they hit the head or when they hit uh, the drunk guy in the head that he had the detonators <laughs> when they got back? I, I don't remember that, but I don't doubt it. But if that's true, why? Why? That guy. The guy who was stumbling around, he mm. came to the job drunk. He did. And he was drinking constantly while he was on the job. Didn't even participate in digging up the C4. <laughs> and everyone knew that guy was drunk. Uh-huh. The guy even said, hey, don't drink on the job. He's like, yeah, sure, I got a boss. He's like, but I need an advance. Yeah. <laughs> because <laughs> For my, my medicine. Debt. He yeah, says my, my medicine. medicine. Yeah. And he's got a debt at the bar. This guy ain't paying his bill. Three months. Can't yeah. believe they're letting his ass in there. I would never serve him. You don't pay me for two He's days. He's got a big job, though, coming he up. He does. He does. You hey, think look, he'd be taking a little coming, more boss. serious? Yeah, that maybe. money's coming. You think he'd be a little more serious. But, uh, yeah, I think that's that's uh, pretty much it in episode five, right? Yeah, Did, did anything else happen? It's pretty much the big thing is they got the C4. And yep. the planes are ready. Oh, they're They've ready to go. They've been ready since episode two. Yep. But they keep going back to them. They keep checking them out, double checking, triple checks. But they're ready to go. Well, I don't know what's going to happen. They're going to loan these... Load these planes up with C four and <laughs> fly it some, fly into a something. biplane into a, a building. I Just don't, hope it blows up. I don't understand what's yeah. going on though. Well, Raji, you know she's all into that. She she wants to die. This bitch is miserable. Oh my gosh, the most miserable person. She's no happier as a terrorist than she was no. before. I don't know why she's doing this. <laughs> but she wants to kill people bad. Yes, she does. Uh, it's got a lot of. Hate. She wasn't supposed to kill those guards because I don't think they were the guards that they were fighting or the army. Right. It was, was a like, Sri Lankan. That's what they army. said. There's a Sri Lankan. Yeah. yeah. She fucking went right through him. Yeah, she did. I, and again, the jiu-jitsu skills on this oh, one. Oh yeah. The rolls, arm breaks. The jits is good. It the is. The jits is good. It's bar none, man. I'm telling you, get this, get this girl. Oh in well, an the octagon. next episode <laughs> is uh, purely Raji showing off the jit skills. Oh, for sure. You got to get her in a cage with a man that knew There's a lot of arm bars. Being done. There's <laughs> yeah. a lot of guys get tackled. Uh, yeah, she's yeah. a killer. dude. Very unsuspecting too, but uh, I can't believe that it took him that long to figure out she was a trained killer. Yeah, like that bitch puts me in a triangle once. <laughs> I'm telling like, hey, that's not no, no one no, else knows not. that shit. She just knocked me out, bro. <laughs> she dislocated my arm. <laughs> I don't understand why they had to look at the video to figure I that know. out. They'd be like, oh yeah, she's a kid. How uh, killed that guy with the bare hands? Yeah, is that enough evidence? I don't know. I don't know how or I do know where she's gonna go, but I don't know how it's gonna end with her. Yeah. Big death, I assume. Hopefully a death. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's blowing something up. She is. She's killing a lot more people, but uh, we'll have to find out. Alrighty, well, that is our recap for episode five, Homecoming, season two of Family Man. If you guys like what you've seen here, please be sure to smash that like button, comment below, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell notification as we drop videos here every single day. Thank you so much for watching and listening. My name is Mason Knight. That is Cash Krause, and until next time. Bye. Bye.